ratio of electrostatic force and gravitational force ratio of electrostatic force and gravitational force of attraction acting between two electrons in the diagram we can draw two electrons these are two electrons having mass me and me charges of the two electrons are qe equal minus e r is the distance between the two electrons which are situated at the points a and b we can denote electrostatic force and gravitational force of attraction acting between the two electrons fg is the electrostatic force experienced by the second electron at the point b due to the first electron which is placed at the point a fg is the gravitational force of attraction acting between two electrons now we can denote electrostatic force experienced by the second electron at the point b fe is the electrostatic force of repulsion experienced by the second electron at the point b due to the electron at the point a now we can write the electrostatic force acting between the two electrons that is the electrostatic force experienced by one electron due to another electron is fe equal 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 qe dot qe divided by r square equal 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 right hand side where qe equal minus e equal minus 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 coulomb equal 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 e into e divided by r square equal 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 e into e divided by r square though the charge of electron is negative we have used only the magnitude of the charge because sign of the charge cannot be used in the expression of force therefore fe equal 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 e square by r square e square comes due to the product of e dot e not due to the product of minus e into minus e so finally we get fe as equal 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 e square by r square which is equation 1 where 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 is 9 into 10 to the power 9 newton meter r square coulomb to the power minus 2 9 into 10 to the power 9 newton meter square coulomb to the power minus 2 similarly the gravitational force of attraction the gravitational force of attraction acting between the two electrons the gravitational force of attraction acting between the two electrons two electrons is given by if g is equal is given by if g equal g capital g me into me divided by r square where me is the mass of one electron and capital g is the gravitational constant which has the value 6.67 into 10 to the power minus 11 newton meter square kg to the power minus 2 Therefore, Fg equal G M E square divided by R E square. Fg equal G into M E square divided by R E square, which is equation 2. That is the gravitational force of attraction acting between the two electrons. Hence, Fe divided by Fg equal Fe divided by Fg equal 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 E square by R square into r square by g m e square equal 1 by 4 pi epsilon 0 1 by g e square by r e square 1 by g into e square by r e square where m e is the mass of one electron which has the value 9.1 into 10 to the power minus 31 kg and m e is the mass of one electron or mass of each electron putting the values we get what therefore Fe by Fg will be what? If we put the values of 1 by 4 pi epsilon naught and here Fe by Fg will be 4.17 or 4.16 into 10 to the power 42. Putting the values of different quantities 
we can write 9 into 10 to the power 9 into 1 divided by 6.67 into 10 to the power minus 11 into 1.6 into 10 to the power minus 19 whole square divided by 9.1 into 10 to the power minus 31 whole square equal 9 into 2.56 divided by 6.67 into 9.1 square into 10 to the power minus 29 divided by 10 to the power minus 73 10 to the power minus 29 10 to the power minus 29 divided by 10 to the power minus 73 10 to the power minus 29 divided by 10 to the power minus 73 finally we get uh, fe by mg as 4.17 into 10 to the power 42 therefore fe by mg equal 4.17 into 10 to the power 42 and we can write fe by mg fe divided by mg is the order of 10 to the power 42 that is the ratio of electrostatic force and gravitational force of attraction acting between the two electrons is the order of 10 to the power 42.